I am deeply sorry for my tacky hairstyle. I need to take a selfie dahil masasayang ang makeup na nilagay ko dahil hindi na kaalis ang bahay para santa siya kung hindi sa pang selfie. I'm just going to grab things one at a time guys ha. So, hindi ko na siya ilalabas in one go. I do not have anything on my face right now except for my moisturizer. And thankfully, galing ako luminis kagabi so I can be this close to the camera. This is a pure olives and wild berries brightening face moisturizer. And I'm going to start off first with primer. This is Makeup Forever Step 1 Primer. Radiant Primer siya. This helps brighten my face. Pasensya na kayo guys ha. Hindi ako masyadong matutorial. Kasi I feel that it's not my niche. And ang dami kasi talagang nag upload ng magagandang tutorial that I leave to them. And I cannot do the dubbing side. It's as if like I'm giving instructions. Mas gusto ko yung parang mas personal, mas chatty, parang get ready with me, something like that. And on my neck. Next, we have foundation. I'm going to use my favorite, of course. Alam nyo na yan, Marc Jacobs Remarkable Full Cover Foundation. This is in the shade Bisque Neutral. I'm going to use my Beauty Blender. It's in this Airport Pro. It's kind of like this casing for beauty blenders when you travel. And this is the Pro one. I'm going to put it at the back of my hand. Remember that a little goes a long way. Okay, konti-konti lang with this foundation. When this foundation says full coverage. It doesn't joke around. As you can see, guys, ito yung walang foundation and this is with foundation. Mostly, ang sinasabi nila is to start at the center of the face and blend out. But, oh well, vowel, I do not do that. I mean, kahit na ano lang talaga. Basta nilalagay ko siya sa face. There you go. Goodbye, redness. <laughs> I'm also going to put some on the eye area to cancel the veins. We do not also forget the neck. For concealer, I'm going to use two things. For the under eye area, I'm going to use this Maybelline one. And for the face blemishes, this Makeup Forever Full Cover, which I swear my life on. I start with full cover and I usually cover my veins. So I have to do the other side as well. Of course, the side then. In the forehead. Nose. Dito din. That's it. Then I'm using the sponge to blend. Dito din sa my lid area. Bring it up to the temples. Also on the other side. Bringing it again to the temples. And also on the lids. Dito lang sa center ng forehead. The tip of the nose, nose bridge. And my chin. Meron ding veins yan. Finish with all the liquid stuff as my base. I'm going to now set it with my favorite Coty Airspun Loose Face Powder. This is how it looks like. And sila, sa ibang bansa, they do baking under eye area. And also here, sa my contour side, I do bake the whole face. And I do not care. I use a lot of powders. Trust me on this, guys. If you have combination oily skin, just do it on the whole face. Put some product dito sa cover. And dito lang ako mukha straight. But before you put it on your face, make sure na walang crease. So I go back to the areas and make sure that there are no creasing happening and then I dive in. Dive in talaga. I am pushing this in. I'm going to look funny but I don't really care as long as my makeup stays the whole day. Konti lang na ilagay ko sa kanya. I'm going to go back at it and bake the other side. You can see creasing already. Flip the sponge, blend, and then apply the powder. This works for me guys. Hindi ibig sabihin that this will work for everybody. If you have dry skin, I do not suggest that you do this. It will look cakey. And sa nose, this area, hindi pa yan nasa set. And also right here. Alam nyo guys, dahil tamad ako, I'm using the same sponge that I used with my foundation. There's nothing wrong with it. I do not ever set my face with the loose setting powder and the brush because magiiwan na siya ng brush marks. It's better to use a damp sponge. And damp sponge kasi mas madikit yung powder sa face. It looks powdery, yes, but later on, we're going to solve that problem with one technique. Putting powder again. Sabi ko nga sa inyo, Malaki ang kita ni Coty Airspun sa akin dahil magastos ako mag-airspun. <laughs> hindi, hindi ko pa nasa-set yung aking neck. Guys, after this step, if I do have time, I go on my phone, check all my social media accounts, and do all of my stuff na pwedeng gawin. I just let this on for maybe mga, minsan nga more than 10 minutes ba. But because this is a tutorial, I'm going to, you know, finish this now. Ito yung favorite kong wipes. It smells so good and malaki yung wipes na to. And then I do not throw this away because later, pwede ko pa ulit siyang gamitin since hindi naman ganun kadumi hands ko. And can you notice pala, I'm already wearing my designs. Wait, hindi nakagit na si Leo. Ayan. And then also the other side, my designs. For my Singapore trip, I'm going to use this facial mist because I'm trying this out. This is the Luminous Cucumber and Mulberry Botanical Facial Mist. Ayan siya. It comes in a glass bottle. Konti-konti lang. Okay, there you go. 
What this does is it kind of melts all of the powder particles on your face, making it look like your second skin. Hindi siya magmumukam powdery. I feel like I enjoy this a lot better than doing voiceovers pag may tutorial. After my canvas, I'm going to proceed with bronzing. So I use the Charlotte Tilbury Film Star Bronze and Glow, and then this NARS Eta brush. And I just get some on the brush and then put it where I want a warm glow. Usually, pag jawline, dati ako dito ko naglalagay. Mali pala yun, guys. Dapat dito pala sa ilalim. And parang ang nangyayari lang is you get a shadow. It helps to make the contour look natural as compared to contour lang ang meron. Hirap talagang lagyan ng nose ko ng bronzer kasi nagko-concentrate siya dito sa parang may bone na naka-protrude. Diba guys, it looks better than having that stark white face. Now, I'm going to highlight and contour the face with this Anastasia Contour Kit. Contouring shade that I use here, pasensya na, zero plano. And then the hollow kind of sucks in the brush. Yan yun lang ginagawa ko. Other side. I do the same thing. So, diba guys, pansin ninyo, yung kanina na parang sobrang powdery ng look, it doesn't look that powdery at all. The foundation shade that I use, it looks like my shoulder. So, ibig sabihin, it matches my body really well. But contour should not go way past where the eyes end or the brows end. So, ayan. There. Kala mo naman pro na pro, but that's how I do it. I go back sa sides ng nose to contour. Now, not worry if the nose line looks dark because we're going to fix it later. Alright, I'm good with this. I'm going to proceed with highlighting. For highlighting, guys, I'm going back with a sponge and I'm going to use this yellow powder over here. I use a pointed side, grab some powder, and then highlight. You can bring it up to the temples, down to a V. Start near the bottom lashes, bring it up to the temples, and bring it down to a V. Like so. Also, put some salids. Para mas mag brighten siya. Especially if you're not applying any eyeshadow, it looks nice pagka maganda yung background na inyong lashes. More powder and then I'm going to apply it sa center ng forehead, down the nose, like so. Oh, di ba my nose ka na. Upper lip, and then your chin. As you can see guys, it's still not well blended. You can see the harsh edges, parang yan. And then dito sa forehead, you can see the harsh edges as well. I'm going to flip the sponge, this domed end, and then I'm going to blend. Sa forehead, just blending the edges. And for the nose, I'm just going to pounce it on my nose bridge. And medyo konting-konti lang dun sa gilid where the harsh edges are. Also in this area, where the highlight and the contour meets, and on the temples. On the other side as well. I'm now going to do my brows. I'm going to use this Anastasia Brow Powder Duo in medium brown and then this Anastasia. I think this is a number 11 brush. I'll start with this dark brown and then do the underside or the lower arch. Now I'm going to do the upper arch and I do not change the arch of my brows. I'm not going to shape the shape of my so that it looks natural. I'm going to start filling them in with what's left in the brush. Since my brows are kind of dark, I'm going to lighten it up with this Hair and Make Heavy Rotation Coloring Eyebrow. And a little goes a long way. Also makes your brow hair stay in place. I'm going to put a little bit here. Sorry, nandito sa kabilang side yung mirror. Other people do, they use concealer to clean the edges of their brows. I'm going to use my highlighting powder so that hindi na madedisrupt yung powder na nilagay ko with any cream concealer or liquid concealer. I'm going to use a sponge, go back with the yellow powder that we use for highlighting at the tip of the sponge. Then I clean the edges. The underside. Airplane is back. Now I'm finished with the brows. I'm going to do my blush. I have this Becca Jacqueline Hill Champagne Face Palette, and now my dogs are barking. This is in Amaretto, and then for my highlighter, I'm going to use this one naman in Prosecco Pop. Grabbing Amaretto on my Wet n Wild Blush Brush. I start on the apples of the cheeks first, and then bringing it up to the temples, pero konti lang. I'm going to do this on the other side, syempre. Prosecco Pop at the side of my brush. That's Tonyo. Large pore side here. I'm going to apply the highlighter from here to here lang para hindi ma-highlight yung aking pores. Ooh. And then blend with my fingers as well. Tip of my nose and then dito sa my nose bridge. With what's left, I'm going to put some on the center of my forehead. My Cupid's bow. What's left on my chin. To make everything melt in just one makeup, I'm again going back to my Luminous Facial Mist to also intensify the highlighter. 
And then with my Shoei Mura Lash Curler that already looks gross, I need to replace it. Ayan o, grabe diba? Sobrang marami na siyang pinagdaan na curl my lashes. Lift it up so that yung curl niya is mukhang natural, hindi parang stick na letter L. Oh, oh my god, I did not. I forgot to press the record button. Hindi ko napakita na yung naglagay ako ng mascara. Sorry guys. If you have been watching my channel, you know that I am super in love with this mascara. Because as you can see guys, kita na yung lashes ko. I do have medium length lashes, kaya lang guys, it makes a big difference. I hate putting on falsies, so ito na lang yung solution ko. As you can see guys, open na yung mata ko. We are almost done. I'm going to line my lips first with this MAC Lip Liner in Rosy Rim. Ayan yung shade niya. And with this lip color from Tom Ford in Forbidden Pink. And sometimes, I do overline my lips. I'm sorry if you cannot understand what I'm saying. Air, okay na siya. Now, I'm going to apply my lip color. This is how the lip color looks like. Hello, pink. This Urban Decay All Nighter Makeup Setting Spray. And I'm just going to do a few spritzes. Ay. Kunyari, lalabas tayo ng bahay at mainit sa labas. Pero yung totoo, nakapambahay na shorts lang ako. Like, now that I'm finished, I don't have anywhere to go yung totoo. Pinakita ko lang talaga ko ano yung nasa makeup bag ko that I'm going to bring to Singapore. But of course, before I remove this, let's take a selfie. And I've been getting questions, guys, kung anong app yung ginagamit ko when I do my selfies. This is just one of the apps that I use. But sinasabi ko sa inyo, pag ginamit niya siya, it does not look like your face was edited. Guys, I don't think na kailangan natin mahiya pag in-edit yung picture. Yung models nga, pinaphotoshop, tayo pa kaya. But first, let me thank... As you can see, I have a new power case. This is from One Victrix, Nicola One Victrix. Thank you so much. I think this is 10,000 mAh, and she sells this for one, too. I don't have to bring a cord because I already have this one, and it has a stand somewhere here. Kaya lang, guys, yun napansin ko. Medyo madali siya magdime, but I think meron pa rin silang ibang colors. But anyway, that's not what I'm talking about. This is the app that I'm talking about. This is Makeup Plus, but she has a sister app. It's Beauty Plus. Today, I'm going to talk about Makeup Plus. So, let's open Makeup Plus first. Oops. Sorry, ginamit ko siya kanina, di ba? Took a picture earlier and what I love is this editor. I'm going to select this one. There. So as you can see, ayan, it's processing. Mmm, nakita nyo pa yung difference. Dito tayo sa tab na foundation. And then you can pick whichever shade. I think I am shade number 8. Damn. You can intensify the foundation kung full coverage ba siya. Ayan. Or kung gusto nyo ng sheer coverage. And then now to my lipstick. As you can see, I'm wearing a pink lipstick. But let's see kung anong itsura niya if I'm going to change to a vampy lipstick. I'm going to put this RD5. There you go. And then I can intensify as well. Ayan. Ang ganda. I'm not going to change that. I have to blush. Yung blush ko dito sa selfie, hindi siya ganong kita. So I can choose whichever blush. I'm going to use quartz. Ooh. Mas gusto ko yan, but I may lessen the intensity. My contour, pwede ka mamili ng contour. Depending if you're opal-shaped, round-shaped, pear-shaped, square-shaped. I have a square-shaped face, so I'm going for this square. Then, for the brows, I'm going to use 02. Nakita nyo black na black, guys. You can change it to brown. I'm going to switch back to black, and then, bawasan natin yung intensity. There, mas lighter na yung brows ko. Next, for the eyeshadow... Wala akong suot na eyeshadow, di ba guys? Pero dito, pwede kang pumili. Right now, I have BR05 on. But I am going to change to, let's see, para something pink. PK02. Not really what I like. Um, BR03. Ayan, mas pek ko yan. Parang smoky brown yung look. Then now, we're off to eyeliner. Since I cannot perfect my cat eyeliner, I'm going to choose yung pinakagrabe yung winged eyeliner na hindi ko magawa. This is L210. Can you see the flick? Tapos pwede mo pa siyang intensify. I'm going to intensify. And then for my mascara, I'm okay with my mascara, but I'm going to put on my favorite N2205. And then intensify. Yes. And one thing that I also like about this, napakadali lang mag-save. There is a button right here, yung check. Isang click lang, nakasave na agad siya sa camera roll. Guys, the facial recognition of this app is so on point. Na tamang-tama yung lipstick, and then yung flick ng eyeliner, tamang-tama for your eye shape. But you can always adjust it. When I click it, tapos nandito ako sa brows, pwede nyo i-adjust kung saan mag-i-end or magsa-start yung inyong makeup. That's kind of like the basic only. If you're looking for filters na tapos na, wala ka nang iintindihin, you have the camera right here. When I click it, 
either take a photo or pili na lang ako ng na picture ko na kanina. Then guys, when it's uploaded to the app, it is automatically beautified and pwede kang mamili. May ice fantasy look, may dark look, natural look, and they also have the pony look. Yung pony look guys, it is in collaboration with Pony, the very famous Korean makeup artist and of course, the owner of this app which is me too. I'm going to put somewhere here sa screen yung mga variations ng pony looks so you also can appreciate. Way a lot more filters that you can ever imagine you can play with apps. But wait, there's more! Makeup Plus was very generous to give two of my viewers. Oh my god, I'm so excited for this. It is going to be two kit giveaways that contains 11,000 worth of makeup each. Wait, nakalimot ako na i-zoom. Let's zoom out. To give you an overview of what you are going to win. First off, of course, okay, this Kylie makeup bag. Wait lang, madumi lang siya. So this is how the Kylie makeup bag looks like. This is one of the very first prices. Of course, it's just a regular makeup bag, but I mean, it's Kylie. The, the graphic is nice. It has this case zipper on it. Sorry, hindi nyo gaano makita. And marami ka mailalagay sa loob. Actually, everything that I showed you in this tutorial can fit in here. Thing special sa loob just says here Kylie Cosmetics by Kylie Jenner. It has a pocket and wala na, yun lang. Next item, this is the Marc Jacobs Remarkable Foundation. This is so far the best foundation that I have tried. As in, wala akong masabi. So I am very excited for the winners to try them. This Becca Jaclyn Hill Champagne Face Palette. Mm, one Becca Luminous blush and the regular blushers right here and the highlighters. Now to set everything in place, I also included this Urban Decay All Nighter Makeup Setting Spray. And lastly, alam kong naghahanap kayo nito kung saan mabibili. It's the Hair and Make Long and Curl Super Waterproof Mascara and I do not know kung black or brown na ibibigay. So that is it. That wraps up this What's in My Makeup Bag plus tutorial. So ko lang kasi parang personal yung dating. It's like I'm just sitting in front of you, chatting with you and then showing you, not giving you instructions. Now if you would like to join my giveaway na I know a lot of you will because Hello, but hindi ka sasali. The app is free and we always post our selfies online. Wala naman tayo napapanalunan. I don't wanna leave you guys without any video so I pre-filmed this for you. The time that you're watching this, I am already in Singapore celebrating my birthday. Masaya kasi kahit birthday ko, ako yung nakakapagbigay. If you don't watch my videos, wala naman din akong giveaways na maibibigay. So this is kind of like the fruit of our efforts. It's me producing the videos and you guys watching it kung wala nga isang side, wale. And again, before I end this video, thank you so much Makeup Plus for sponsoring this video. At the of Shen's Addiction. I know you know her, The Uncreated Life. For introducing me to this app makes me happy to make my viewers happy and it's kind of like a, my birthday special for you. Maraming salamat sa panonood and if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up, comment, and subscribe. Thank you for watching! Bye!